So I love terrible movies and there's a bunch of movies on Rotten Tomatoes that have either no score or a really low score. So I'm curious to see whether those scores are warranted and these movies truly are the worst or if they deserve a little bit of a higher score. So today I'm going to watch the 1987 film The Barbarians. I know nothing about this film. I don't know the cast. I don't know the director. I don't know the storyline. Um, judging by the title, I'm guessing Barbarians will be involved. Um, but that's all I really know. Uh, I'm hoping it's at least bad in a good way like it's at least watchable and goofy and funny um, so if you have any other suggestions for bad movies please comment below and let me know and thank you so much for sharing in this first time watching with me and as always please like comment and subscribe to this channel and check back often for more awesome content yes already this looks so goofy I'm excited. Dirt Master, hello. And contain the secrets of music, of joyful laughter, of human kindness. Okay. Quite the quite the stone. Are they gonna steal the precious ruby? Bonked him. So this other tribe's this other tribe's attacking them just to steal the ruby, or oh, oh, this whole tribe's getting chopped. Flamethrower, oh, right in the face, oh, ah. oh, right, yeah, the queen's the one guarding this ruby. Okay, okay. Here, you know where to hide it. What does that mean? We have no choice. Go. Ah, uh, where is he gonna hide it? Oh, great cape. Oh, I like that pink furry thing. That's fun. Come on, flamethrower, get him, get him. Uh. Oh, right in the gut. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Oh, ouch, 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 ouch. These guys are jerks. Yeah, what do you see in your crystal ball? Get him! Uh. Oh, it also explodes. Okay, that's fun. Bane. <sighs> ah! Oh, what's this? I'm liking it so far. It's definitely goofy and uh, campy, but I'm excited to kind of see where it goes. David Bowie? David Bowie from Labyrinth is in this? I'm just kidding. Oh, bonked him. Oh, she got bonked. Right on the head. Will her helmet have saved her? Uh, I don't know. Oh no, the kids, no! Ah, biting! Ah! Oh! Oh, that was a ferocious bite. Oh, he bit off his fingers. Uh. If you let them live, I, I promise I'll do whatever you want. Uh. To obey me. Yes. Oh, girl. You're not going to be happy for a long time. These two will never die by my hand or by the hands of my men. That doesn't mean he won't get other people to kill them. She's like throwing the ash of those fingers into their faces? Or that of my subjects. Then they shall die by their own hands. She's wrapping them in a cocoon of... What? Oh no. Brothers were separated. <gasps> no! Work in the prison called the pit. No! They're just little kids. This actor was in, um, I feel like he was in The Hills Have Eyes. The 1970s Wes Craven film. He looks familiar. He's got a very distinguished face. <laughs> Oh, 
Not just dis a distinguished face. He has a very distinct face. That's what I meant to say. Oh my. Oh my. and unbroken. And they grew until they were men. Yeah, they did. But not ordinary men. Barbarians. Oh yep. Hauling rocks all day will give you quite the physique. Mm-hmm. Yeah, wouldn't they eventually be able to become stronger than these guys? Uh, and no pants. This is not a big, uh, they're not big into pants over here. Oh, ah, that makes my hand hurt. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> it's like, poke. Okay, now they're at least letting them defend themselves. I'm guessing they obviously still haven't found the rubies or the... And they still think she's holding on to them somehow. She's like, I don't want no stinking jewels. I want my freedom. I'll give you all of my time. My thoughts. But you keep me in a cage. That, that could dampen things. Yeah, that might ruin the relationship for sure. You've grown me. Like you dare question my power, Karate Chop A. And I'll keep my promise. The bastards will kill each other. Oh, plot twist. Okay, okay. Ah. Are these two actors? Are they actually brothers? They do look similar. in the gut. Ah! Oh! Ah! That's so fake! Oh god, that was so bad. There wasn't even any blood come out. His hand just disappeared. He recognizes him. I turned my brother's dead! They told me the same thing about you! Oh! They're making their escape. They don't need no stinking fighting. Bye. Yes, the dramatic fall to your knees. So now that they've escaped, they're gonna go back and try and save Queen Canary. His neck is just so strong, he was able to break the rope. Ah, uh, okay, I don't know if that's possible, but okay. Uh, they're like, what the heck do we do now? It's the open road. The mark of the open road. Right where Nanny put it. They're like, oh, right, we remember you now. Cool, you're one of us. Good thing we didn't almost kill you. No big deal. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> so this guy's gonna arm wrestle these, just so I'm understanding. I'm going, I'm going. Uh, Unless he has a robotic arm under there, or something. He has a live snake also coiling around his neck at the moment, so, you know. Like, what did you expect was gonna happen? This guy's got the arm size of a tree trunk. Like, come on, he's gonna win. Uh, the snake is secret weapon, he's gonna get the snake to bite him. That's cheating. That's cheating for sure. Yeah, like the guy's huge. He's obviously. Why would you threaten him with an arm wrestling? Like, why would you think that's something you could win? Bonked him. That mallet seems like it's made out of pure rubber. Like, there was no weight behind that. Bonk, bonk, bonk. It's definitely not the worst movie I've seen. Like, if you go into it with the expectation that it's gonna be goofy and like there'll just be action sequences and these two greased up, mostly naked men running around, like. Not, not the worst way to spend your time, you know, you know, it's entertaining. I'll give it that. Am I expecting a mind-altering plot? No. No, I am not. Kadar is so in love with Canary that he's neglected all his other women for years. So, be careful in that. Ah ha 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 
<laughs> this fake boulder is gonna very gently fall to the ground. Okay. Alright, he's like, well, where do we start? Very subtle. Okay, okay. There we go, that's better. Yeah, put a blanket. Yeah, okay. Okay, so let's go get a sword to defeat a dragon to get the ruby. This is turning out to be more like sci-fi than than I was anticipating. He's like, oh, by the way, actually, let me just, uh, yeah, one last look before I go. No, yeah, oh, no, yeah, no, yes, no, yes. Uh, okay, Ugh, like in front of their like mom, like their adopted mom. The secret's been discovered. Soon I'll have the ruby and its power. Oh no! It will be defenseless against the dragon. Got it? Yeah, like they're not like these two aren't great actors, but like I'm enjoying their like. The few lines they do have there, they're delivering, but yeah, they're not, it's not great acting, but they don't need to have a huge emotional range. They're playing barbarians, so. Ah, what is that thing? Is that supposed to be the dragon? Ah, oh, what is this thing? No! Ah, gross! Uh, ah, he ripped his whole arm off. Uh, oh god, he's coming back for more. Uh, li -li 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 -li. What is this thing? It's like a rat or... Uh, yeah, what is that thing? Uh, it kind of looks like the, um, in the Princess Bride. The rodents of unusual size. She pulls it out. Uh, oh gosh. Ah, whoa, what were those? Uh, gross. So clearly just people in like monster costumes. How did they get to the ruby before? I thought they needed the sword to defeat this dragon. What is this? Like. Whoa, arrow, bye. Oh, apparently that doesn't affect him at all. Whoa, chopped off his head. That'll do it. Yep. You're not afraid, are you? Are you kidding? Uh, uh, bonked him. Bonked him. So? So what? So where's the ruby? I don't know. Canary said the ruby was going to be here. Where? Yeah, they're right too here. late. They already got, she already got it. Yeah, right here. No what is this? Is this the dragon? Oh, he's not a very pretty looking dragon. He's because he's seen some things. Oh my. Okay, we're, um, that's, mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a rather uh, suggestive looking dragon. <laughs> like a friendly dragon, like she's hoping you can tame him. Yeah, just whistle for the dragon. Oh, oh God, why is it green? Oh, <laughs> so gross. Ew, just the green slime. Ugh. Gross. Are they gonna crawl inside him? Because they think the ruby is in him? Oh, gross. Ew. Just crawling around the inside of a dragon's belly. Blech. Now, where did I leave my keys? Ew. I don't have it. I thought you had it. What do you mean you don't have it? I thought you had it. Don't take your eyes off the ruby. Don't take your eyes off the ruby. <laughs> never gets old. Never gets old between siblings. Mocking them publicly. 
So the sorcerer got eaten by the dragon after she stole the ruby, and then they climbed inside and stole it back. Okay. I wonder how many times there was a uh, wardrobe malfunction while filming. Of she's Kara. She'd never betray us. Oh, well, she also is the one who has the ruby, so maybe, you know, maybe stay close. He just stabbed himself, didn't he? Oh no, he stabbed her? Oh no. Oh gosh. Well, now you've done it. Ah, uh, you killed your lady. The one you actually liked. Oh, bye. So the light in the ruby went out because she was part of the, part of the magic of the ruby was with her. Oh, dang it. Canary is dead. Yeah. Oh no. So oh. The song is finished. The laughter silent. The dream dead. Oh. Up? Back to a ruby? Okay, is she back to life? Or is she now the one who has the magic in her? Because she didn't give up. That's how they decide the queens, by putting the jewel in their belly buttons. If the slipper fits, if the ruby fits, then you'd have to have like a giant belly button. That's like a pretty big ruby. Oh. This is how the ruby decides. Boop. I feel like if you just like breathed in your belly, yeah, you would drop out like. Child. Come here, quickly. Give me your belly button. I need to know. Hold her still and uncover her belly. <laughs> Such a weird thing to demand. I need to see that belly. Show me your belly. Oh, and of course it sticks perfectly, yeah. It's like a weird version of Cinderella. If the ruby fits your belly, you will be the queen. Booty, 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 booty. Oh, look out! I wonder how much sand they got in their heinies. Ah, why is he blinding them? He killed your mom. No, not your mom, but like your adopted mom. Your mother figure. Oh, it's coming back. Okay, okay. I don't need no stinking shield. I would not, uh, I don't think he's gonna do well against the guy with an ax and a sword. Oh, rude, rude indeed. Oh, well, I mean, maybe wear armor and not just a loincloth. But still, ah, so rude. That would hurt so much. Whoa, double swords. Whoa, bye. Whoa, that would hurt. Oh, gosh. They're good shots. Oh, two swords through the chest. Ah. It's one way to go, you know? Cheese and crackers. And now the tribe's back together. They got the ruby. They can go on more adventures. And it ends just the way it started with them, the tribe traveling across the country. Except she's the queen now and she's got these two studs for friends, bodyguards, other adventures I'm sure. So that was my first time watching the 1987 film, The Barbarians, and overall I enjoyed it. It was silly and campy, and but overall entertaining. Um, it was about this tribe that has a magic ruby. The ruby ends up being stolen, as well as twin boys that are part of this tribe are held captive. They're forced to work for this evil overlord, the Dirt Master, um, and eventually they grow up break free and try to get the ruby back. Um, they end up succeeding and then a new queen is crowned and the tribe is able to 
be free again and go on doing what they were doing before. Um, but yeah, it definitely wasn't anything life changing, but it was entertaining. If it was on TV at two in the morning, I'd probably watch it again. Um, I feel like the two actors that played brothers were actual brothers in real life. They looked very similar. Um, comment below and let me know. They weren't great actors, but it was funny to kind of see the camaraderie between the two of them and them playing off each other and being just siblings. Um, that was entertaining. Thank you so much for sharing in this first time watching with me. almost felt like it had a little bit more of a sci-fi feel than I was anticipating. There was dragons and there was rubies and magic, um, but I love sci-fi, so that was an awesome surprise. And if you have any other suggestions for bad movies, please comment below and let me know. And as always, please like, comment, and subscribe to this channel and check back often for more awesome Awesome content. Whoa. Dirt Master, hello. Ah, he ripped his whole arm off. Lee, 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 lee. Ah. Oh god, he's coming back for more. That would hurt so much. Ow, 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 ow.